It's starting to be an exciting time for local farmers and well residents like myself as the Milton Chamber of Commerce gets ready for the farmers market. Despite the COVID-19 pandemic, the Milton Farmers Market has been given the green light to go ahead this year. Krista Lancaster is the manager of the Farmers Market. She says it will once again be held at the Milton Fairgrounds. Um, and the reason for that is to allow for the maximum amount of vendors and the maximum space for shoppers and vendors uh, to meet pandemic protocol. Um, something else that's different this year is that we are only permitted uh, food vendors so we won't have community and craft vendors this year, unfortunately. We do miss their presence. We had to experience that last year as well, but uh, the protocols require that it be only grocery or essential uh, based services only. Pre-COVID, the farmer's market was traditionally held on Main Street. Despite having to move it to the fairgrounds for COVID reasons, Lancaster does say they did receive some positive feedback last year. It's uh, actually a location that the vendors and the community really enjoyed. Um, the logistically speaking, there's less um, worry about shutting down Main Street and, and having to deal with the logistics of that. There's more space there and it's still local to downtown. So we have partnered with the downtown Milton BIA. They have a booth this year that will feature some of their members. So restaurants and uh, other um, plant and uh, businesses that we can get involved this year will still have an opportunity to participate. So how will it all work? Well, Lancaster says it won't be that much different than going to the grocery store. Of course, we have to be cognizant of the pandemic protocols that are required to make sure that we have a safe operation that everybody can enjoy. Uh, when customers do come to visit, uh, we encourage them to, you know, make their shop uh, kind of as quick as possible. Um, to assist with that, we have posted on our website a site plan uh, with a listing of vendors. We will have two entrances and two exits uh, to reduce the traffic uh, coming into the market, and we'll monitor it um, at the tents at each uh, entrance location. There will be sanitizer at uh, throughout the market, and uh, we do ask that uh, masks are worn. Uh, per the protocols. We also have signage throughout the market that will remind um, customers of the safety precautions that we're taking. Some other things that that include would be uh, that there's no food consumption, unfortunately, within the market area. So we have prepped our vendors and uh, those serving food on site to prepare grab and go meals um, and to do things like posting a phone number to place an order, that sort of thing, so that you can place your order and take it with you when you go. We've also partnered with Local Line, and uh, thanks to our sponsor, Milton Ford Lincoln, uh, we've been able to provide Local Line as an option to our vendors. So if they choose, they will have the opportunity to do curbside pickup. So for those customers who would prefer not to attend the market but do want to place an order, the curbside pickup will be an option this year as well. The Milton Farmers Market runs from May 22nd to October the 9th from 8 till noon. For more information and to keep yourself updated each week, go to miltonfarmersmarket.ca. Reporting for Halton News, I'm Melissa Candelaria.